An Afghanistan human rights group said this past week that this year has been the most violent since the Afghan war began with the U.S. invasion in 2001, and civilian deaths have risen slightly with the increased insecurity. Afghanistan Rights Monitor says a massive increase in troops from the United States has failed to stop the Taliban-led insurgency. It said, quote, in terms of insecurity, 2010 has been the worst year since the demise of the Taliban regime in late 2001. Not only have the number of security incidents increased, the space and depth of the insurgency and counterinsurgency related violence have maximized dramatically. The group says about 1,074 civilians were killed and more than 1,500 injured in war related incidents in the first six months of 2010. That's compared with 1,059 killed in the same period last year. In late December, President Barack Obama ordered an extra 30,000 American troops into Afghanistan as part of a new counterinsurgency strategy designed to reverse the Taliban momentum and speed up an end to the nine-year war. But ARM's mid-year report, Civilian Casualties of Conflict, says Obama's policy of intensifying operations against the Taliban has not disrupted, dismantled, or defeated the insurgents. On the contrary, it says, quote, the insurgency has become more resilient, multi-structured, and deadly. Most civilian deaths, 661, were caused by Taliban insurgents, who the report says showed, quote, little or no respect for the safety and protection of non-combatants in their armed rebellion against the government and its foreign supporters.